Castle Neuschwanstein is probably the most famous German castle and it's easy to see why, as if taken straight from the fairy tale book it is incredibly beautiful and photogenic. Schweinstein is located in southwest Bavaria, Germany, right next to the Austrian border. With more than a million visitors per year, it is one of the most popular tourist destinations in entire Europe and is always crowded, so parking can definitely be an issue. Alright, this is crazy. Like, there's hordes of people there at Neuschweinstein Castle. Like, we couldn't even park on the first parking because the guy said it's closed, the second parking lot closed, totally full. Uh, so we hardly, like, found a place after, after 10 minutes of searching. It's complete craziness. There are actually two castles in close proximity here, Neuschweinstein and Hohenschwangau. Also nearby is a beautiful alpine lake called Alpse. We weren't particularly interested in going inside the castle, so we decided to take a walk around the lake and see if we could find anything interesting. It seems that the weather turned on us and went from bad to worse. There's fog all over, all over the lake now. Uh, no views, no mountains, just a bit of forest and the water. I guess it's a nice autumn mood, but it's not really, you know, like the epic view that we were kind of hoping for. Neuschweinstein is from the Bridge Marienbrücke. You can either hike to it or take a shuttle bus. However, I also found that with proper conditions you can actually get a pretty strong composition directly from the parking lot beneath without having to go anywhere. It's getting obvious by at this point that we aren't gonna get any sunset tonight. So uh, we got here to the beginning of the hike to the castle viewpoint. We, we're gonna make the hike just to see uh, if we can get any shot at all. At this point it's so foggy that I'm not certain we even gonna see the castle. But I guess we'll just use this day as a location scout and we're not gonna get an epic shot tonight, so I'm just gonna go up there and check how it looks. It 
Hey, we kind of got to see the castle. It's right there behind me. So, all foggy. No sunset, no really good picture here. So I guess, yeah, we'll just uh, make a shot anyway. See what happens. Waited a little bit and it actually started to clear. So um, right now it's a pretty nice image. Uh, I like the lines to both sides of the castle, like the fog forming the lines with the fields and the river. It actually looks pretty cool. So it's getting dark and we are packing our things and going back down. And I just want to finish this video with a bit of philosophical advice. And that goes, you don't always get what you want, right? Especially with landscape photography. Um, we got lucky today and it's cleared out and we made the shot. But I wouldn't at all be upset if it remained foggy. I mean, it's, it's all about experience, I guess. It's all about hiking up here and enjoying it and viewing it. It could have been the case that we didn't get the picture. And it would be fine. We would come back here another time and still get it then. But the experience is still, you know, more important, I think. So the moral of the story is don't get upset. Just enjoy uh, being out, enjoy being here, enjoy every moment. And uh, I guess that's my advice. So Katja got me this new hat. So that now everyone can assume that I'm a Bayern Munich fan. Apparently that's that's so that I don't stand out too much from the touristy crowd around here and blend in better. Um, 